This is called Pastor Making Me Look Bad. I don't know what happened. He must have woke up in beast mode. I'm at the eye doctor. Yes, I went to the gym. No, it didn't go well. A little bit of a late breakfast. Hoping this is all right to eat when it's expired. Never stopped me before. All right, checking in for lunch. Chicken tortilla soup. Kiwi strawberry flavored water. It's officially day nine of this whole journey to healthy, this whole vlog idea. Let me just tell you a couple things I've learned in the past few days. I don't know what it is about trying to improve yourself, but it seems like as soon as you start trying, everything comes against you. Now, if you're a religious person, you might say that's the devil trying to stop you. If you're not a religious person, you might just say that the universe has it out for you. Either way you look at it, I would almost call it factual that if you start out on a trail of doing something good, you're going to run into things that are going to stop you from trying to continue doing something good. That's the negative. Now let me give you the positive. In the first week of trying this, I lost 7.2 pounds. That's the first positive. The second thing that's really pretty positive in my opinion is that I've proven to myself that I can still run on a treadmill or uh, across the parking lot or down a sidewalk. I've proven to myself that when I make up in my mind, when I get determined to do something, that I still have the ability to do that. I've also proven that I don't have to give in to all the excuses and the ideas that are floating around in my head because the reality of it is, is that I can take anything and turn it into a good excuse for why I shouldn't continue doing what I'm doing right now. Running's bad for my knees. I've got a lot of metal in my leg. Chocolate just tastes better. Editing these videos takes a lot of time. Couldn't that time be better spent? Here's the reality. When you start looking into yourself every single day and you start putting a camera in front of your face and logging everything you do all day, you are forced to look at every second of your day. How well am I actually using each one of my days? So what have I learned? Number one thing I've learned, vlogging's not as easy as you would think it would be. I have to spend every single one of my breaks looking for a place to film this stuff. I'm not in some crazy city where there's just places all over the place just begging you to come shoot cool scenes. I'm in a building, in the same building, all day, every day. But what it essentially comes down to is that all of those excuses aside, I still have managed to find a way to make it happen. And I don't intend to stop, and I'm saying all this to encourage somebody else out there that's watching this that they shouldn't stop either. I have lost 7.2 pounds. I also went to the gym this morning and could barely get myself to get on the treadmill and run. The struggle is real. I had a million different reasons today for why I didn't want to do anything. I had a million different reasons for why I didn't want to go run on the treadmill. I had a million different reasons for why I didn't want to lift any weights, for why I didn't want to touch those stupid ropes. I had a million different reasons why I didn't want to do any of these things. And you know what? The reality is, this is this is the real deal. The reality is, I let a lot of those become excuses for me, and I let those re those I, I let those million different reasons rule my morning. And so yesterday I got up and I was dancing and I was spitting Monday in the eye, and Tuesday whooped my tail. But I already got up this morning and didn't run on the treadmill as much as I should have. I barely ran a mile and a half. I didn't accomplish any of the things that I wanted to accomplish. But the truth of the matter is, this is the difference between every other time and now. I'm not stopping just because I had a bad day. Bad days happen, but if you look back, your good days far outnumber your bad. Dinner time. Chicken carbonara, salad, cheese, a little bit of light ranch dressing, and a piece of like some French bread. Looking good. Look good to you? Look good to you? Yeah, pretty much. How about you? Yeah, I know it's good. I've had this stuff before. Yeah. You were choking. All right.